are taking a look at a 2020 Chevy Silverado today. Uh, looking at getting basically a new car, and this was one of the ones that I was really, uh, really, really liking. And I've always liked trucks. My dad's got a Ram, and I've been liking these Chevys. So this is a Chevy Silverado uh, Trail Boss 2020. Um, so it's a nice package. It's a really solid package. This is like the V8 version. We took a look at some V6s, and I was like, I kind of want the uh, the better engine and everything like that. So we're taking a look at this one. Probably gonna test drive it a little bit today, but this might be the one. We've already taken a look at like two other ones, um, but I really really like this color. Um, it looks is a nice truck. That's a really nice truck. So we're taking a look at this one today. Gonna see what we can do and uh, see what kind of offer we can make on this. Um, it is a used truck, so 2020, but it's got like 20,000 miles, so it's not it, not super used, and uh, it looks to be in like really good condition too. So this one also has a, uh, it's got a cover on the bed. It also has a spray in bed liner too, so uh, that's all set to go. I'll show you guys like the inside of it. It's probably locked. Yeah. I would assume. So I'll show you guys once we once we get some keys for this thing, but it's a really, really beautiful truck, man. Really nice truck, so. Um, I like the color, it's like a dark gray with the uh, the black accents for like the trail boss. And we've got the uh, the side runners here, uh, which looks kind of cool. And uh, yeah, it's got like the black wheels. More of like some off-roading uh, tires. And it's like an off-roading kit. It's got like a two inch lift kit. So I'm gonna check this thing out. I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think here. I don't know, kind of a nice looking truck. All right, so we got the keys. We're gonna take this thing for a little drive right now. And uh, yeah, I got my parents with me because I have no, absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Uh, so we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna take this thing for a drive right now. But. Hey, I can, I can video it. Yeah, you can. Our drive. Yeah, you can. Okay. Look at this. We'll show the, uh, the bed liner. Yeah, this thing looks to be in very good shape. Oh look, you just have to do that, huh? Yeah, so we got the, the spray in bed liner already on here. So, and we got the cover. Yeah, looks nice. All right, let's take it for a ride. Car, the truck's off. Yeah. No one would. Uh... All right, here we go. I think it's really nice. I think it's very nice so far. Uh, definitely way smoother than we, like I drove the same exact one. It was a 2020 uh, Silverado Trail Boss. And uh, the tires, like, the tires on it are meant for like off-roading and stuff like that. It's like the off-road package, but um, they were very, very noisy. Like specifically like 55 to 60 miles per hour. Uh, this one didn't, haven't noticed anything so far. So I think the tires are like uh, supposed to be a lot newer on this and uh in much better shape it's got some kick to it for sure <laughs> and yeah it drives really well super smooth so far all right so we are back had to get a check had to go to the bank we are back to actually pick this thing up and get the keys technically signed for it bought it last time and then we're coming back to uh to pick it up today so we're gonna go inside and see how this process goes we got everything signed already so i think it's pretty much good to go and um yeah, let's go check it out and see what we need to do. All right, uh, you got a documentation fee of $250. You got a $50 uh, registration convenience fee. You got your 8% sales tax in Cuyahoga County. You got $20 for a 45 day tag. You got a title and filing fee of $2360. Your other door amount would be $45,724.36. There. You also have a five day return policy. So we are all set. We just dropped off the check. We're getting the keys right now. We got my man uh, Mark over here. So he's taking care of us today. Yep. Thank Congratulations. You Appreciate you. Thank yep. You. Take care, Ryan. Yeah. Thank you, man. So we are all set to go. And uh, yeah, it's the uh, the new truck right here. So this is going to be the new vehicle that we use for everything. So you know, been rocking the Suzuki for a long time. We got a little upgrade. Yeah. So that's pretty much it, guys. Yes. Yeah, so we got a. Uh, Chevy Silverado 
Uh, it's a 2020 Trail Boss Edition. Um, it's like this dark midnight gray, I think, something like that. It's a dark gray color. I really, really like it uh, with the tires and the wheels on it, all black. And uh, yeah, thing looks amazing. Thing looks really, really amazing. So I'm super, I'm super happy about this. Like my first ever big purchase I've ever made. So I'm like super proud of myself um, for getting this. And yeah, you know, I've been like saving up money for like a long time. And you know, I've been doing YouTube and all this stuff for, you know, it's been five years now that I've consistently been doing this. So uh, it's really cool to see like finally able to get myself something. So um, yeah, so we, we, we bought it and um, you know, this is gonna be really cool. Yeah, let's go take this thing home. We're growing the calves this prep. First time, I'm trying to do this consistently. Um, so we did this the other day too. So we do it twice a week, hit calves, three, four sets, really hard. I mean, we're in a deficit, but for men's physique, your calves do show on stage. So it's something that I should have been working on for a long time, realistically, but we're gonna try it twice a week, put some effort into it and see what happens over the course of this prep. Maybe it'll grow a little bit, maybe not. So you guys, we got the truck and uh, I couldn't be more happy with my decision, honestly. Just looking at some cars and stuff, like graduated college, I needed to get a new car. I'm potentially gonna be moving here soon too. I needed a new, you know, new vehicle and uh, I just couldn't really get excited about anything and I test drove a couple cars and stuff like that and you know, there was things that I liked and there was, there was different cars that I liked and things, but uh, you know, I, it was just nothing I could get super excited about. Um, and I've always liked driving trucks. My dad always had uh, a Ram. He, he had two different Rams. He had a Toyota Tundra, and I used to drive all the time during high school. And I always loved it. I saw these Chevys, um, and I really, really liked them. And it was like something that I could like actually get really excited about. So I started looking more into these, and like this was, this was definitely like the way to go for me. This is this is probably exactly what I wanted for right now. So I'm really, really happy with my decision. Super happy that. You know, I've had so much support over like the past, you know, four or five years of doing this that uh, like I've never bought, like I've never made a big purchase in my life like this before. So this is, this was huge for me. I was driving around uh, my parents, you know, old Suzuki uh, that they got for a few thousand dollars back in the day. And I was driving that around for the past two, three years, you know, down to college. And that was fine because down to college, I'm not going to lie, like things get a little bit crazy. Cars getting broken into all the time. Um, and it's it's not necessarily a scene where you want to like, first off, not where you want to bring a good car to. Second off, don't want to bring like a big pickup truck to either. I needed a new vehicle and this was this was the perfect thing for me. So I'm really, really happy with my decision. I got this. Um, and like, I appreciate all the support over the years, you guys supporting me and, and throughout college and stuff like that. Like this is the reason I was able to get 
you know get this truck basically so super happy with my decision and uh, you know at the end of the day it's like you never know when you need a truck for things if you need to tow something or you know I have the whole bed in the back if I need to transport anything at all um, and it's got the cover on it too and it's got the bed liner already like installed and stuff like that so uh, yeah just like really really excited about about this truck so um, yeah couldn't be happy with my decision so I appreciate all the support like I said the past four five six years like I've been doing YouTube for seven years now it's insane um, so thank you guys and supporting me through college you know it's time to like move on to the next chapter and this was like the the first big thing that I you know took upon myself so um, happy we got the truck team Chevy right now so anyways guys thank you for all the support Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're not already. We got more content coming soon. We are nine and a half weeks out right now from competition. So um, yeah, it's gonna fly by. I'm telling you, man, it's gonna fly by. So I'm gonna try and get as much content as possible. Just enjoy the process, enjoy the journey of it. Like I feel like sometimes we get so focused on like the end goal that you don't enjoy the journey. And then seven, eight weeks now from now, it'll be like, you know, I'm almost ready to compete. It's just like, you gotta enjoy the whole process of it. Just trying to enjoy everything, take it all in, and uh, you know, put in my full effort for this thing. So I'll see you guys in the next video. And uh, yeah, peace.